What's up guys, for the past couple of years I've been using a corded lawnmower to cut the grass in our garden near our home. As the distance is around 50 meters, I had to use a long extension cord and drag it after the lawnmower. I wanted to make lawn mowing easier, so I looked into battery powered lawn mowers and found a good offer for the 40 volt works WG779E. The offer included in the same package a battery powered trimmer. In the box I received a pair of lithium ion battery packs at 20 volts with 36 watt hour power connected in series in the lawnmower delivering around 40 volts. These use the works PowerShare technology making them compatible with other works devices like the included trimmer. A multi-language user manual for the trimmer. Mounting screws for the lawnmower handle. Some cable hooks and the handle for the grass clippings bag. A multi language user manual for the lawnmower. The handle of the lawnmower. A grass clipping sketcher. and extension rods for the handle. The lawnmower has a nice compact size weighing 12.1 kilograms without batteries with well-sized plastic wheels of 160 mm on the front and 180 mm at the rear. Attaching the handle is easy. First, we connect the extension rods using the included screws and then we can fix the entire handle assembly onto the lawnmower with the help of two other mounting screws. With the handle mounted, we can then fix in place the cable clips. Next, we need to attach the handle of the grass catcher as this is used if we want to bag the grass clippings. The collector has a capacity of 30 liters. The small grass gauge will stay closed if the collector is full. For mulching you can cut the grass without the collector attached. I wasn't sure if the included batteries would provide enough usage time to cut the entire surface, so I ordered additional batteries and as it later turned out it was a smart decision. Must have accessory included in the box is the dual battery charger that can charge two battery packs simultaneously. It charged the included 2 amp hour battery packs in around 1.5 hours and the additionally bought 4 amp hour battery packs in 3 hours. The included battery powered trimmer uses the same type of battery pack as the lawnmower 
and the only thing I had to do before using it was to attach the plastic guard with a screw. With the batteries fully charged, it was time to take the lawnmower for a spin. Connecting the battery packs was straightforward and during operation, these are protected by a plastic cover. Also, you can check the remaining power in the batteries using an indicator. The lawnmower has a cutting diameter of 34 centimeters and a cutting height between 20 and 70 millimeters that is adjustable using one of six available positions. For higher grass, you should do multiple passes and cutting should be done when the grass is dry. Using the higher capacity battery packs, I managed to cut around 75% of a 160 square meter yard and for the remaining 25% I used the included pair. The trimmer worked like a charm for cutting the edges around the fence. It was very convenient that I could simply unplug one of the battery packs from the lawnmower and connect it to the trimmer. To summarize, I've been using this setup for the past couple of months and I am very happy with how they work. Thanks for watching and till next time, take care.